everyone this is me randy and welcome back to a brand new video it has been about a year since i've last made a new reaction video and i am back with a new one for you all today this is actually my first ever k-pop themed reaction video and this is a topic that is very very big and i feel like this is a topic that i just had to talk about as this is breaking news this actually just came out around an hour ago and I will actually leave the Sompi news article link in the description box down below. Now the two main things that were discussed about in this Sompi article is that Big Bang are expected to have a comeback in the spring of 2022 and Top has left YG Entertainment. It was stated that his contract expired and he didn't renew his contract and he is no longer an employee at YG Entertainment after 16 years being in the company. Now, first up for Big Bang, the comeback. Now, I know that many of you are saying to yourself, Randy, this is not the first time YG announced that Big Bang were gonna have a comeback when in reality they didn't. And you were right, they actually had plans for a comeback for the group last spring and also there was a rumor going on in 2019 that g-dragon was going to have a solo concert so this is not the first time that we've heard news about a potential big bang comeback but i don't know about you guys but i feel like we may actually get a big bang comeback this year it has been since 2018 since flower road came out but Technically, it's also been since 2015 since the Made album came out. So it has been quite some time since Big Bang has released anything. Music in album and also other um, content wise. It's been quite some time. So I really am hoping that Big Bang does come out with new music because I really do think it's time for them to come back with some new stuff it's been a while yg didn't do anything for their 15th anniversary last year so i really am hoping that this is true and that we do get a big bang comeback finally this year but i really really made this video to discuss about top leaving yg this is huge news oh my goodness i just want to say that i am just so happy that he decided to not renew his contract with YG. It doesn't matter if you've been a fan of K-pop for 15 years, been a fan for 10 years, been a fan of five years, or just got into K-pop yesterday. Every K-pop fan knows that Top has had a lot of issues and a lot of problems with YG Entertainment. And I'm so happy that he doesn't have to deal with that no more. And I'm just, Overall, just really happy that he decided to not renew his contract. Now note, he is still a part of Big Bang. He's just no longer an employee at YG. So before any of you ask, Randy, is he still a member of Big Bang? The answer is yes, he is still a member of Big Bang. It is just that he is not employed by YG Entertainment anymore. So that means that hopefully in the upcoming year or down the line, we will get more top music you will get more top just goods and hopefully one day we will get a top solo concert because that is a dream of mine one day to go see him live but especially in a solo concert and i know that top has been working on solo music for the past couple of years now so hopefully he's able to release his projects real soon because i know he's been working really hard on them and even last year he was seen doing some recordings as well so overall i'm just really happy that he decided to not renew his contract it's just the best for him and i'm just glad that he is now able to either be an independent artist or sign at a different label because I really feel like YG just really had so much wasted potential with Top. In my opinion, I really feel like Top could have been at that G Dragon level if YG just put their differences aside, aside, excuse me, over Top because we all know that YG, the person and the executives there, just were never really a big fan of him to begin with. And I just wish that they could have 
just allowed Top to really be more than what he was. Just a lot of wasted potential with him. And honestly, I really feel like Top could have been on that G-Dragon level and even that Taying level if YG just tried to work with him and just really gave him a chance to shine. And it's really a shame that that happened to Top. But at the same time, I'm so happy that he is out of there. And I can't wait to see what he's going to do next. And I just wish nothing but the best of luck to him and also for the rest of the members as well. I just can't wait to see what's going to happen next. And I'm just overall just really happy with this news. It's really great to hear some positive news for Big Bang for once. Um, with Taeyang now being a father, which congratulations to him. And now with the potential Big Bang comeback and with Top leaving YG, I'm just really happy to see that, you know, Big Bang is starting to get some good news finally because it's been a long time since we've heard anything positive about Big Bang. And I'm just happy that finally that we're starting to see that. So I'm hoping for a Big Bang comeback. I'm not going to say that I'm excited for it now because I'm waiting to see if it really happens because this is not the first time that it has been rumored that Big Bang's gonna have a comeback. So I'm hoping that it's true especially since it was announced from Sompi. They're pretty good and reliable source when it comes to K-pop news. And overall, I'm just really happy that Top is no longer at YG. And I just can't wait to see what he's gonna do next. And I just can't wait to see if he's gonna sign to label or if he's gonna stay independent. But regardless, I'm gonna support him in the rest of the members of Big Bang completely so yes this is the end of my reaction video thank you all so much for listening if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already all of that would be greatly appreciated and i hope to see and talk to you all in the next video take care